Hey, Nolly Williams here again, and I'm super excited for this video because guess what? You have a superpower. That's right. You have a superpower. You are a unique human being, very unique. And God, when he created you, he created only you. There's no other person like you. And that's why in this video, I talk about how you need to hone your superpower. That's right. You do have a superpower and uh, it, it came with you at birth. You've got you've to develop it as you go through life. That's why I'm the business healer. That's what I'm here to teach, train, and coach you to your ultimate greatness. You've got to develop it, uh, but you've, it, and you've got to hone it as well. You've got to hone it. So in this video, I'm gonna teach you how to hone your superpower. Check it out, enjoy it, and if you like the video, give it a thumbs up. Be sure to, to give it a like, also subscribe to my youtube channel and be able to put lots of more free content out just for you leave me a content below let me know what you think your superpower is and how you can uh, improve and hone it even better well enjoy the video so number one you want to hone your superpower that is the very first so every one of you has a superpower say i have a superpower, I have a superpower. yes you do you do have a superpower and when God created you, he created you unique and different from everyone that has ever existed on the planet ever and ever will exist, okay? And he created you with a superpower. So back when I was a kid, we used to watch, um, they call it the, the uh, Justice League, okay? Now I know I'm dating myself, I see some smiles. Now it's like the Avengers, right? You got all these people. And so when you, when you want somebody to, like if you have a, uh, the reason why they're the Avengers, there's a lot of superheroes, but can they all do the same thing? No. And when you want someone like to finesse and go through a keyhole, you need that little tiny guy. What's his name? Ant-Man. Ant now, do you call the Incredible Hulk when you need Ant-Man? No, we need, we need Ant-Man. We don't need the Incredible Hulk for this. Cause Hulk, what's Hulk gonna do? Smash, bang. He's just gonna smash up everything. But we don't need that. Now, when we need somebody to smash, do we call Ant-Man? Not necessarily, we're gonna call Hulk, right? So there's different roles and you have a genius. In fact, it's attributed to Albert Einstein where he said, everyone is a genius. But if you teach, a, but if you, uh, if you, if you, um, what, everyone is a genius, but if you, no, but if, Everyone is a genius, but if you measure a fish for its ability to climb a tree, it'll live its whole life thinking it's stupid. Thank you. I was just seeing if y'all were paying attention. That's all right. <laughs> Everyone's a genius, okay? But if you measure a fish for its ability to climb a tree, now here's the thing. If you measure a monkey for its ability to climb a tree, it's a genius. A fish can't do that because it's a fish, but it's a genius at swimming. Throw the monkey in the sea, what, see what he does, all right? So here's how you hone your genius. The disc, the passion test, uh, you could also do the genius test. There's several tests. Gallup did a poll, said 70%, this is 150,000 Americans that were polled. 70% of Americans either hate or dislike their jobs, 70%, okay? And the question always is, what do you want? You have to know what you want. Because the way God set up the universe, he set it up in such a way where you have to know what you want and then what you, what you desire desires you. Let me say it again, what you desire desires you, but you have to know what you want. Imagine jumping in the back of a cab or Uber or whatever, whatever. Uber you do it in, in advance, but just say a cab. He says, hey buddy, where are you going? You say, well, I wanna to go to this house. And he starts going and then you give him a different address. No, let's go here instead. Then you give him another one. And then a, a third, a fourth one, fifth one. What's the, what's the cab driver gonna do? Kick you out of the cab, eventually. And that's what a lot of people are doing to what we call the universe, God, God you know, whatever you call um, the, the Almighty, is that we're, okay, I want this. No, I want that, I want that. You're not sure of what you want, okay? Because you've never, uh, you, you've never taken the time to study yourself, understand yourself, and, and figure out what are my desires? What do I truly desire? Okay, so these are the different tests that we're talking about. Um, I actually wrote a, a, a book called Discovering Your Divine Destiny because I've been a Bible teacher since 1988. So when I turned 18, I started teaching the Bible. 
And that's the longest thing that I've taught of anything that I've been teaching, okay? Uh, my wife and I, up until COVID, had a weekly Bible class that I've held since the time I was 18, okay? And so COVID, COVID messed up a few things, didn't it? It did. So, uh, but, but find out your, your genius. Very important to do that. So you want to design your business and your life around your genius. See, that's when life becomes fun. When you know you absolutely suck at some stuff and you're really good at other things and you only focus on what you're good at, that's when life becomes a lot of fun for you, okay? Hey, I hope you enjoyed the video. Hey, I wanna invite you out to Nolly Coaching Club. That's right, the Nolly Coaching Club is where I'm able to teach, train, and coach you every single week to your ultimate greatness. Now you can join for just a dollar. Go to nollycoaching.com and I'll see you on the inside.